hi everyone so this is the fourth video in the series and we are going to create the delivery document so to post a delivery document the transaction code is VL01 and we need to give the shipping point and sale order number the sale order number last time we have created was this one 16974 press enter So let us see the quantity. So we need to give the picked quantity here, one, and then we can save. So we can also check the date. Date should be the same today's date, and then save it. So we get a message that delivery has been saved. This is our delivery number. So let me save this also. Now once we have done the delivery, till now we have created sale order in the process testing and then now we have created delivery document. Till here there is no impact on financial accounting, means the GL value has not been updated, there is no impact on the GL accounting. So the next step is, yeah we can see the sale order for the document flow, so go to VA03 and give your sale order number press enter and if you click on this icon display document flow so here we can see till now what all actions we have taken so we created sale order we have done the delivery and this is the packing request is generated by system automatically the next step is to post the goods issue so for that also we are going to use the same t code vl0 so instead of 1n we are going to use 2n 2n means change change delivery document so this is our delivery document number 8001891395 press enter so this is the change mode screen from here you can see this option post goods issue so once we click on post goods issue okay so we we get a message that the storage location is not defined for the delivery item 10 so we need to go back we have to check the storage location so this is the storage location was blank so we given the storage location here now click on this icon post goods issue we got the message that delivery number this has been saved successfully okay but in the back end system has also created a PGI document so let's go again to VA03 sale order display and we are going to see the document flow so now you can see here goods issue delivery right so this is our PGI number the document number so if you double click on this and then select this click on document display and we can see this is the PGA document in the sales and distribution module this will show like this it has it has movement type 601 if we want to see the accounting document because from here we are going to get the impact on financial accounting so click on accounting documents here we can see COGS account is debit and your stock account is credit all right with the same amount so in this video we have created delivery document and then we have posted goods issue and in the next video we are going to see how to create the billing document and then we are going to analyze finally how the system has determined revenue GL account as per our configurations which we have done in the second video in this series so thank you so much for watching this video please do like share and subscribe and i will see you in the next video till then bye thank you